Kayo po ay nanonood ng nag-iisang kababayan today. This is your premier resource for anything and everything Filipino and Filipino-American. We're not just about entertainment. We're also giving you tools to not just survive but also thrive here in the U.S. And that's why today on Talk Tuesday, we're going to be opening our phone lines and ask and answering your questions about real estate. Like I said earlier, should you rent? Is this a time to buy? Or if you're buying, should you also sell? And some uh, investment properties out there as well. Is this a good time, mortgage rates and all that, that's today on the show. Magandang hapon po sa inyong lahat. My name is Janelle Sawyer, Kababayan in Los Angeles. And also joining us this afternoon is a familiar face. We see her every other Wednesday here on the show, the real estate buzz, Miss Mia McLeod. Help, welcome to Kababayan today. Thank you. It's great to be here, like yes. always. Miss Mia McLeod of McLeod and Associates. And today she brought along an associate with her, right? Yes. Ma go ahead and introduce... Uh, well, I just want to thank, actually, um, Michael Jerkan for joining us today. He's one of our McLeod Associates, and um, he specializes, actually, in investors, flipping property. So he, he really has a nice niche going on for himself. Right. Is it the time to invest? Invest and buy. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right. Invest and buy. Um, How easy is it to buy? When you say that it's a time to, because money is power, cash is gold, oh, right, or yeah. something like that, right? Cash is king. Cash yes. is king. Yeah. 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 Cash is so king. So do you you need to have cash in order to buy at a good rate? Is that? No, not necessarily. I mean, for investors, it's it's different. But let's say you're a first time home buyer or a move up buyer. There's a lot of programs like the FHA program that we've discussed before, only three and a half percent down, and lender gives a lot of credits for borrowers for uh, closing cost cre uh, closing cost credit and things like that. So you'll be surprised. It doesn't take as much money as buyers think to get in. Right. You know, there's been times where we've been able to get buyers in with you know seven, eight, nine thousand dollars. Right. That's with down payment. Okay. Um, and you know you using the lender credit to cover their closing costs. So when we talk about buying as well, are there seasons? Like January, it's the month, is it the month to buy? Is there such a thing? You notice a little bit more activity, reason being, because we just went through the holidays. And uh, over the holidays, people, you know, they don't want to move. They don't want to And to hold off on decisions, yeah. right? Yeah, yes. you know, it's, okay. it's, it's harder for the ham family just to get up and go kind of thing. Right. Um, it's better for investors, though, because mm -hmm. investors tend to take advantage of that because there's less people trying to purchase. Mm -hmm. um, but as far as a single-family residence, per se, um, no, January is pretty much the beginning of the year, and it starts off pretty strong. Right. Yeah, new January. life, new home. Yes. Exactly. If you're looking for properties, here are some properties listed with yes. McLeod and Associates. Let's talk about this one from uh, Seal Beach, right? Yes. You yep. know, I always like uh, featuring our listings in the beginning of our shows and things like that. So this property just got listed in Seal Beach. Mm -hmm. It's a three-bedroom, two-bath listed for 598000 in Orange County. Great location. It's a pool home. Wow. So it's a standard sale too. So mm -hmm. if you're interested, you know, Salvo Glang Po. Ayan. Yeah. Good for families, right? Great Orange for County. Orange great County, great system. location. Mm -hmm. The neighborhood's really good. It's in a nice uh, private community. Um, it's a one story. I'm a big fan of one stories. Mm -hmm. And again, it is a pool home standard sale, Seal Beach. Right. And yeah. here's another property. And Mia, this one interests me because we've talked about this before. And yes. I thought that you already sold this. This yes. one is in um, Pomona. Pomona, yes. And this actually was um, a, a client that called in from okay. the show. Right. So this was um, highlighted on a previous segment here before. It was in escrow. Buyer did cancel out okay. due to financing reasons. So mm -hmm. there's a lot of reasons why buyers will cancel out through escrow, whether it's through financing, a home inspection, uh, maybe negotiations fall through, mm -hmm. maybe the appraisal value is not there. But nonetheless, I still want to highlight this particular deal. It's also a one-story, four-bedroom, okay. two-bath, um, listed for 278000 I mean, this is really Beautiful. good. Beautiful. Yeah, wow. it's really good yes. for investors um, and for first-time home buyers. And there's a guava tree in the back. And, you know, it's, it's, a, it's a very cozy home. Right. So, and okay. it's priced really well. All so. right. And this one is sold. Congratulations. Yeah, sold. And the reason why I wanted to highlight this property in Chino is also another exclusive community called The Preserve. Mm -hmm. And, um, I mean, you can see well, what kind of deals are out there. This is a three-bedroom, two-bath. Uh, over 1,700 square feet with a loft, 
sold for 335000 So you can see the type of deals. I just wanted to show kind of a variety of the type of things we have from just listed to back on market to the type of deals that are out there, for instance, like this Chino, right. Chino property. Beautiful kitchen. We saw that picture. Yes. And when we return on the show, we're going to be talking about that. If you're thinking of selling your property, yes. you perhaps can get more for that yes. with some updates yes. and improvements yes. in yes. your yes. home. We'll talk about that when we return on the show. Plus, answering your questions. Don't go away.